fashion friends this is Emore J Couture and guess what happened guess what I finally found out okay I went to a party the Diddy's party and I stopped dead in my tracks I saw this young lady and she was fabulous from head to toe I walked up to her I was like miss where did you get your clothing from your accessories are hot your get up your get up is awesome she said that she made it the name of the young lady is actually Story Afton let me make sure I get that correct okay Yes, it's Story Afton Abstract. And baby, when I say her glasses are off the chain, sweetie, they're off the chain. I want you guys to get into this interview, check out another upcoming designer who's definitely going to take over the mainstream media scene. Baby, she's hot. Let's go check her out. Let's be cool. Why you ain't tag them in? Mm -hmm. I didn't know you Not all of them. Not the ones from this weekend. So, I am, when I saw you at the Diddy's Club, like, you literally stopped me. One, you were talking to this guy, I believe he was a producer of something, and he was just going gaga about your glasses, he was just all over it. And then, like, I had to stop you and get to the outfit. Once we started taking the pictures, and I saw them in a the digital camera, the artwork about it. Yeah. It was fabulous. So, how did you come up with these concepts? Like, where did this, it just, it seems so out of this world. It's, I love how it's, it seems a little tribal, because everything is, like, you use paints. Of and different type of um, abstract art. I really do enjoy that. What what gave you these concepts? Um, me personally, I'm a very abstract person. Mm -hmm. I always think outside the box. I always been creative. So I love colors. You know, um, I'm all about like you know abstract Ooh. things. Wow. I'm all about abstract things, colors, putting things together, and things out of the ordinary. Mm -hmm. So, you know, um, I started doing the glasses, and I was putting different things and stuff on them to make them look cool, but then I'm like, you know, they need something else. So then I was like, yeah. you know, I always painted, I always spray painted, did different things and stuff like that. So I said, let me bring them to life a little bit more with paint and make them more abstract, because that's how my personality is, abstract. I enjoy, I like these. I yeah, like they're them. totally cool. You think these match my outfit? I like, I am in love with this. Yeah, they look really It matches my you. style. This um, is pretty totally. cool. Yeah. Is there any these other? These are really cool too, because you see like they have those guns on them. Guns? Yeah, they have guns okay, on them. Okay, Beyonce bottom. video phone. Yeah, totally. Oh, that is, I see that. Yeah. And you have detailing in it, which is of also course. excellent. Now, yeah. is there any celeb right now these that's rocking your style? Circus Soleil? Yes. Now, is there any celeb right now that's actually rocking your eyewear currently at the moment? Um, I gave them to quite a few people. I have my eyewear, cool. Kim Porter, oh, okay. Little Kim. Oh, yeah. I quit Sierra the other day at the Clyde Davis party. Now, how was your life when you see a celebrity? Is it like, trying to give them something? How, how does that work out? Well, you know, I'm always fly when I go out. So, of course, you know, I'm one of their own. So, of mm -hmm. course, they can totally feel my vibe when I walk up. So, I walk up, I'm like, hi, you know, I'm Story Afton. I would love you in my eyewear. I think you're mm -hmm. fly, you know, whatever, whatever. You know, I give them my eyewear. So most of the time, nine times out of ten, they mm -hmm. always really love it. And then we go from there, you know? Well, let's talk yeah. about some of these pieces you have here. Of course. Now, oh my goodness, you guys have to see this. Now, because I was a little, I was tricked a little bit. I'm like, oh, these are some cute necklaces. Wow, girl, I love these. Right. But these aren't necklaces, are they? No, actually, they're earrings. Earrings. Air chains. Air chains. Air chains. Very abstract air chains. Really long, really dramatic. Yes. Yeah. Over the top. How much would something like these go? Um, the earrings go for eighty dollars and up. Very okay. As like these, I have one with the ribbon. Check out the really detailing cool. in her earrings here. Yeah, they're really hot. This Nothing like it. One of a kind. Please and they're not even heavy. Copy. Please, nobody copy. They're not even. Oh, you know they want to try, but oh, they're only, totally always have, on you. But this is in my head, so they can get it, but they won't really get it. Okay. Okay. I'm short of a genius when it comes to creativity. This is okay now. Yeah, totally. I am loving it. You are too fly, but do you model your own stuff? Of course, all day, every day. You being so That's where my pretty. inspiration comes from myself, because I dress up all day, every day. My and, own and these are you as well? Um, no, this is actually a vintage piece. Styling? Yeah. So you just got style all over. So yeah. would you ever take on a role as actually styling a celeb, rather than putting your work on them? Would you actually style a celeb? Of course, I do a little bit of that too. I style different people and stuff like that. Um, no big names yet, but I'm up and coming with the styling things, but I'm really good with fashion. Um, but I style quite a few people already. Yes, and definitely. I'm gonna put some more because we're about to get into this interview. Uh, cool. And I want to look good doing it. We're going to move into the couch section. Yeah. And I want to know more about Story's line because this is...
Okay. Well, I have a friend. His name's Celine Cherry Pie. He has a fabulous swimsuit line, mm -hmm. and he's doing a segment of Rip the Runway. Rip the Runway? And I'm Are going you to serious? design all his accessories and eyeglasses and all that kind of cool stuff for Rip the Runway, which is February 26th. February 26th. Is that going to air on BET? Yes. Are you going to be there as well? Yes. Well, you can work the runway too because you look good. Okay. And that little waist. Okay. And that hips. Okay. Yes, honey. So definitely expect a lot of, you know, feedback from that. Okay. Um, With the MTV Awards coming in, definitely are you going to try to get anybody to rock your Of thing? course, definitely. I'm on the hunt for Rihanna. Anybody who knows Rihanna, Rihanna. anybody who can contact with <laughs> and, Oh, and Amber. Amber, too. Oh, and I gave Amber a pair. Amber? And I had, yeah. She was here yesterday. Oh, she was? She was at, um, I think she was at a, I don't I don't think it's Wale Children. party. Oh, at another party? It was a party at night. You going saw on. her last night? No, I, I missed out. Oh, I went really? to bed, but sure. that's I gave definitely Amber, someone. The pair I gave Amber is dope. Really? Have really you seen dope. her in the media with them on yet? Not yet. And why didn't she oh, wear them yet? Wear Amber, wear my glasses. What are you waiting for? They are dope. Yeah, that's right. What you I really like these. Look at these guys. Let's start to get detailed. It's, I like these. Yeah. Really they feel like it just gives me mermaid. I don't know yeah. why. It just gives me mermaid. The chains hanging really cool. You know what? Also, just gives me that movie, um, Waterworld. Show the coins on the side. The coin. Yeah. Where coins? Oh, this is fly. Yeah. Put them on. Those will probably look hot on you. What y'all think? Get into this face. Get into the. Don't get into the shape up. Get into this face. <laughs> oh, I like these. How they look? Mm -hmm. Y'all like? Y'all need to invest, honey. Trust and check these ones. They're Revy 2020. Which one? But everything 2020 is yeah. black and silver. So this was the ones you wore at the Diddy party, right? No, those are the ones yeah, with the gun. You have to get oh, the, the gun. gun. Yeah, the gun. Those look crazy on you. Wow. How I much would a pair like these, Fran? Those would be 95. 95. Yeah. Have you ever heard of a store called Handmade? No. I on didn't. Sherman Oaks? No. They actually are really good because they take in like a lot of artists like yourself. Oh, cool. And you buy a booth, you rent it for like three months. Oh, really? And you can sell your product there. But Handmade, Kim Kardashian was going to um, set up a booth there as well. For, oh, wow. For something, but. It's called Handmade? It's Handmade in Sherman Oaks. It's oh, right across really? from Ooze and Oz. Oh, cool. So that's a really great, awesome oh, yeah, place to put your, your work. Like, oh, for real. Okay, great. For real, for real. For real, this for real. Fun. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. And those yeah. are like very like Indian, Saudi Arabian, futuristic chic. See, all my stuff is has some type of chicness, but themes like these are Saudi Arabian futuristic chic. You know they what I mean? Have that these are like cool. gumdrop Willy Wonka in a chocolate factory chic. You know what I mean? These is like Circa Soleil on sheet. You know what I mean? Come on, give me some more. These is like seashell on the beach pina colada sheet. How about these here? These is like come and get me uh, <laughs> Perla sheet. Because you can wear these with your underwear and your thigh high boots for your man and they'll still look really good. You can mean Naomi Campbell sheet, honey, on that beach. Yes, these is just like. Overseas beach stuff. Yeah, just like walk on the beach with my bikini on. It's nice outside. Let's go to lunch. The, the Tokyo girls are going to eat this lady alive. Story. Oh my God! Do you know how bad I want to tackle Japan? That's my. I, I, I want to tackle they Japan. That's what I want to do. Alive. The Japanese is going to love me. That's like my whole. I can't wait to like tackle Japan. It's going to be a wrap. They're going to eat you alive. It's going to be a wrap. This is going to be awesome. And they will. So I'm looking for Nigo. Nigo. Anybody who knows Nigo that hangs with Pharrell. Yes, baby uh, Nigo yeah. that owns Baby Nate. Please contact me. Okay, I'm going to finish that one.